The Glenbrook Pinders Railway is not just the running of trains. There is a lot of hard work done behind the scenes. JA 1250 Diana, flues are being made ready to swage out. The first step is to place the plug into the end of the flue which is to be swaged out. step is to bolt the flue into the jig to stop it from moving around when the pressure is applied. And now the hydraulic ram pushes the flue onto the plug with many tons of hydraulic pressure. To get the plug out, the hydraulic ram pushes several tonnes of weight onto the plug via an old boiler tube which has been placed inside the flue. With a little heat on the flue, the plug comes out with a bang. The swaging is completed and now the jig is unbolted. We see the plug being pulled out, which is made of cast iron and is very heavy. The old boiler tube comes out from inside the flute. Now the flue is taken away and replaced with the next one to start the sequence all over again. Ryan heats the flue ends to stress relieve the metal, which is the final process of this job.
We now go back to 1998 when the photo of JA 1250 Diana hangs in pride of place in the workshop. All the cladding and the cab have been taken off the loco for close inspection after major boiler repairs and the loco has been taken outside for steam testing. It's not every day one gets to inspect a 49-year-old lady with all her cladding off. Yeah. Alan inspects the safety valves and she comes into life. All her boiler parts are inspected time and time again to make sure everything is safe. There's always a steam leak or two, and they're always dealt with promptly before they become a problem. Another wood fire is put on to help bring the steam up slowly. With the safety's lifting, she's happy to be fully awake once again. <laughs> 
The ball inspector carries out his inspection while the baller has a full head of steam. At the end of the day, all the scar was blown out of the dry pipe. Now hang on to your hats. JA 1250 Diana is now another step closer to a new working life on the Glenbrook Fundage Railway.